Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to Tuesday, the 18th of April. It has been a morning of absolute torrential downpours, like tornado kind of downpours or hurricane. And then all of a sudden it stops and the sun comes out. Right now we're kind of halfway in between two of them. You know, Kelly, I'm telling you, that looks like pine trees, those those little saplings. I know. Like That's a freaking pine tree. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. Pine trees grow faster. Yeah, right there. They planted pine trees out there. I may be wrong. Okay, that was pines, because now there's, I see firs. They mixed it all up out there. How cool is that? Maybe there's some cedar in there as well. If uh, it ever dries out enough out there, maybe we'll go walk around and see what all kind of little, little starter trees they put in there. They put a lot of them in there, it's awesome. That's not a good way to start your day. No, not good. Well, Mama, I've got one crazy busy day ahead of me. Yep. I don't know if this may be a, a real yeah, this may be a real light vlog today. Yep. <laughs> Crazy busy. I know. Well, we'll see how it all works out. Yep. Let's, let's uh, take a deep breath and go for it. I know. <laughs> okay, get ready. You guys ready for an update on the BMW service department? And it's also going to be Can-Am Spider. Look at this. Getting walled in. This is gonna be epic. It's gonna have a fancy floor. It's all gonna be decked out. <laughs> very, very exciting. And on June 16th and 17th, we're gonna have an official grand opening with the CEO. A BMW is gonna fly out for this thing. We have a ribbon cutting and all kinds of stuff. So look forward to that here in a couple of months. But look at this. Cool. How many of them do you have? Just the one? Well hello there, SV peeps. Look at this beautiful spider. But if you guys remember on Friday, I was putting this uh GS together. All I had left was to put the battery in it, flash all the updates, well, you know, set it up for services and stuff. There's no updates on it. It was, it was full integration level. Put a tire pressure skid pan, put the battery in it, set all the service stuff, register it with a BMW, not to a person, just saying that, you know, I set everything on it. And I did the PDI and all that kind of good jazz. But anyway, I snuck that in. And uh, it finally dried up enough out there, which now it looks like it's about to rain. <laughs> to take it for a little rip. This is a 2017 R1200 GS Adventure or GSA. Oh, please don't be raining. Oh, it's coming any second. We'll make it quick. Literally two minutes ago, the sun was out. Wow, it was beautiful sunshine a while ago. It was all that. But this is a, a, a lower chassis version. I really like the lower chassis GS Adventures. If I was to buy, I'm still getting my coat zipped up. Oh, here comes the rain. If I was to buy one of these, it would be the lower chassis version for sure. Oh yeah, I don't know if it's gonna rain, it's gonna soak me. Nothing nicer than getting a brand new motorcycle all water spotted. Which means I gotta go back there and clean it all up. Look at the FJ Cruiser. Yeah, baby. Just like those little little speed bump things there, the, the GSA goes over it compared to a GS. I mean, I need to do some research and see. Well, everything, it's just gonna show everything's different. I've like compared part numbers and like everything internal is different on them. I don't think we've had a triple black in the low chassis. 
Look how different that looks when you're riding it. These things are epic. And I can't quite put my finger on it, but there's just a more solid, refined feeling to this thing. It's like riding my street glide. You just feel this, like, utter refinement. It's like this thing has just been perfected. It's kind of the feeling you have with this in relation to the standard GS. I'm not dogging the GS. I'm just telling you there's a difference between the GS and the GSA. Performance-wise, there's nothing different. Different between the two. But, in a sense, it is, because I think the suspension works so much better that it just makes it so much more pleasurable to ride. Oh, look at that. Somebody left the door open. Probably got the water off the screen, too, huh? Will she fit feet on the pegs? Uh, yeah. Now I need to find one of my little hockey puck things here. I'm not allowed to put a stand down on that Italian towel without, without the little side stand puck. She even rolls nicer. <laughs> it doesn't. In my head it does. Hmm. This isn't going to be exactly in the lineup. I'll let them figure that all that out. Because if I put it where it needs to be, it'll, uh, Nobody can walk behind it. Now, you have GSA, the high and the low. You can physically see the difference in them. You just look at the difference between the little duckbill thing on the on the front to the front fender. You can you can clearly see the difference. If you look right here, and you can see the height in the back. Do I love them GSAs? All right. Well, as you can see, she's still here. Oh, it's my son flashing flashlight at me. Um, obviously she's not sold because one of you three awesome fans that came in and visited today said the salesman was trying to sell it to you. So. I'm starting to question whether the thing was ever sold to start with. That would, uh, well, I'll just leave that alone. <laughs> I don't know. Let's get you a little better view of the low chassis triple black adventure here compared to the old GoPro. The old Hero 4 is going do good in low lighting. I do like the black. Watch what happens when I try to turn it on. Warning, warning, warning. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you guys. We got another limited. I don't know about the elites. Huh? We'll, those we'll even get. That sure is pretty with that front wheel. <laughs> well, little woman, we got out late again today, and the sun's out again. Boy, I just missed getting absolutely soaked just riding a new bike. Yeah, I kept like pouring. So it was sunny and I wait, I go, finally it's dry out there. So I go put my helmet and all that stuff on and I come rolling out and the sun is completely gone. Oh. And I was about halfway to Vancouver Toyota and it started sprinkling. So I did a quick turnaround. Oh, I love how it's getting to be where there's more sunshine than rain. But still not enough dry to make it safe to ride a motorcycle yet. Sure is amazing. How many trucks come in here? What's funny is sitting here, you can't really tell how many they are. They're just like layers deep out there. You see them all coming in with their little duffel bags, going in taking showers and stuff. Pretty cool. I love all the trucks. 
truck this morning. Some guys are smart and stay away from the crowds. <laughs> Ooh, look at them dark clouds. Mama, with Abilene, it's got to have love, love, loves. And Matadoon, too. But look at all that sweet sunshine. Yep. Sounds like it's it. Oh, yeah. That's the red winged blackbird. You know spring's coming when you hear the red winged blackbirds. Heck yeah. That's cool. That That's the sound. first one I've heard this year. Yeah. He's in that pine tree somewhere. Oh, man, I'd love to take your beautiful self for a ride. I got videos and BRP and compliance tests. I got all kinds of stuff I gotta get done. No fun. Sorry. So I thought I'd just let you guys listen to the birds here for a second. Let's see what the birds sound like from the front. Mom and that old Lily. Two peas in a pod. <laughs> Always. It's so easy. Well, hello there, YouTube. <laughs> it keeps getting crazier for her. It's very, very busy. Their staffing her. is going away. <laughs> yeah, and it's, it's not enough for as busy as what they are. But they've they got some. Uh, some people in the pipeline to get to get hired just that summer sneaks up on you or spring as it is yeah and you start getting that nice weather and people go motorcycle crazy so it's been kind of a, a madhouse around there for those guys up in the parts department it's weird that it just worked out the way it is that they ended up with such a small staff but you know people move on to bigger and better things you know yeah you just got to get the new crop in and somehow another train while it's still crazy busy. I know that's the hard part. Yeah. So I don't I don't know what to think about the the old GS Adventure still sitting back there. But anyway, I got yeah. a very nice demo. Yeah. You know, it's not the yeah. one I'm most enthused to ride. It's still a very cool. Yeah, ride. very cool. You know, the more enthused you are to ride them, the the more you're gonna ride it. Yeah. But I don't know should be lucky that I yeah, have what I have. Exactly. You should be Which grateful. I am. I'm very thankful. Yeah. Just yeah. Not how I planned this for the last I know. year and a half or whatever. But yeah. It, it, life is what it is. It's always changing. Oh, yeah. Heck, yeah. Yeah. Never stays the same. Never know what it's going to throw at you. Yeah. Boy, that black. That triple black GS Adventure. The thing's... You know, I always thought they were pretty, you know, but I was always, you know, that black and think about getting it dirty and if you know, wipe it, it's going to scratch you or show the scratches anyway. I don't know, that thing's growing on me even more and more. And I really do like the lower chassis yeah. of the of the adventure. Love those adventures. They are cool. Yep, they They're are the cool. bad boy of the bunch. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, just a, a brief thing on the weather. It's just been one of those crazy on and off things. Why not? You that never know what it's going to be. Thing. i never seen it go from one extreme to another like it has the last, especially today. Oh, why not? Today was crazy. And what's weird is that all that rain would pour. And then within 15, 20 minutes, it because the sun's beaming down, it'd dry right out. I know. That's because they have asphalt. Yeah. Yeah, we have dirt. <laughs> oh yeah, I know that. You know, in the city's warmer and everything. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You gotta yeah. squeeze. You gotta catch those things just right. Get out. Get out for whatever test ride you need to do quick. 
Yeah. You're about to get wet. Yeah. The old saying, wait five minutes. I mean, it is literally you wait five minutes. Yeah. No, no joking aside. It is crazy around here. Yeah. That's nuts. Got a big spider job I'm still working on. And, you know, first and foremost, the f most, um, the, the, the tree nice gentleman that came in and said hey you guys way from cool. all over the place that was really super cool you guys and yeah. a couple of you spoke to for for quite a bit that was very nice yeah that's so sweet heck yeah that's really nice one of you they tried to sell my my old demo to <laughs> <laughs> that's funny but anyway yeah it was really cool meeting you guys get a chance to chit chat yeah mm -hmm. They even come up. I don't know if both. I know one came up and said hey to the mama. Yeah. Did the, the, the one or all all three of them? Just come the up? one that I know of. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It was so chaotic. It's like a blur. It was a blur. You're lucky if you got your receipt. It was just. <laughs> you know, it was nuts. Yeah. You look like you're tired too. Yeah. It's a very frazzled day. Yeah. Long days when they're like that. Yeah. But, Anyway, and the things coming along, they're moving right along there with the BMW and Spider Service Center downstairs. Yeah, every time I go down there to get a part or something, it's like, no, I, before. Now where do I go? Yeah, because it was just like wood. <laughs> did, they're did on you, the floor. Now there's walls, and I'm going, well, I can't go through here now. So I you know, went around. On uh, June 16th and 17th, there's going to be a major official BMW grand opening, and the CEO of BMW is flying out to oh, be really? here. Oh, how exciting. And the Hannah's and everybody, they're going to do a ribbon cutting ceremony oh, well, and all kinds of so stuff. that's going to be so cool. Can't wait for that. That's going to be really cool. Yeah. That'd so be they want that awesome. service center done and looking good and running. Yeah. So they go, when's it going to be done? I said, it's going to be quick because they want it up and running. Yeah. So that's that, way cool. Very exciting. Real cool. And Ryan's going to come down with me, our son. So he's going to. He's going to be down there working on spiders and whatever else, but probably mostly spiders. It'll keep him busy during the summer, that's for oh, sure. Oh, yeah. But, Mama, we need to, we need to oh, slip out. got to roll. Yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys so very, very much for watching. We really do appreciate it very much. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And you guys have a wonderful day tomorrow. Uh, and you guys are just getting more amazing with the comments and stuff. You I, guys it are just, so adorable. Yeah. I just thought I'd like to work on it. I'm going to go, oh, I wish I could just sit here and answer these things, you know. Aww. You guys are being so awesome. Thank oh, you guys. You guys like, are so sweet. And mentally, you guys are way cool. Like, we yeah. love you guys. Yeah, we love you, man. Yes. <laughs> All right. Until tomorrow. All right. We will talk See to you then. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. We'll be chatting with you through the day. Be another Come on adventure. For another day in our lives. <laughs> uh <-huh. laughs> we'll see you then. Bye. Bye bye now. <laughs>